What up guys, my name is Tita and today I'm going to be taking you guys through my arms and steel workout. In today's workout, we'll obviously be focusing on the bicep, the tricep and all aspects of your arms. The main goal of this workout is to fly through the exercises with minimal rest and obviously once you get to the end, rest for one to two minutes and then go through and do a couple more sets. Let's go. Starting off with easy bar curls. 10 reps guys, let's go. Make sure you really squeeze at the top, guys. Make sure you squeeze. And let the bar come down slowly. Squeeze. Let the bar come down slowly. Make sure you're breathing too. This is a key exercise for building your biceps, guys. You can really feel the blood flowing. Squeeze. A few more reps. Sweet. Next exercise that we'll be doing is tricep push downs using the strap X. So what you want to do is place your arms firmly and the handles, place the cushion part on the top of your neck and you just push down. Really squeezing at the bottom guys. Make sure you keep your elbows tucked. Just push down. Squeeze guys, squeeze. Aim to push to where your hips are guys. And then come back up to the 93 angle. Push. Push. This is killer, guys. Let's go. Sweet. We're going to go back onto our easy bar. And this time, we're going to be targeting a bit of our forearms and our longer bicep head. Using the forearm curls. Let's go. I'm shoulder with the pot. Let's go. 10 reps. Make sure you're breathing. For more tension, have a wider stance. Same thing. Focus on squeezing at the top and letting the bar come down slowly. Next exercise we're doing is going back onto our triceps and we're going to be performing tricep dips. For this exercise, it will be strictly body weight and we're going to go for 10 reps. Let's go. So you can use a bench or in my instance, I'm using a couch. And you just want to come down to a 90 degree angle, explode up. Come down slow, explode up. Come down slow, explode up. And make sure you keep your core engaged throughout the whole movement. If you're a beginner, you can bend your knees a bit. That'll make the movement a bit easier for you. If you're more advanced, obviously leave your feet out in front of you. Or if you really want, you can always put a box under your feet and that'll make yourself a bit heavier. Sweet. Next thing we're gonna be doing is attacking our longer bicep head using the banded hammer curl. This is one of my favorite exercises, guys. And trust me, trust me, these will get your biceps looking huge. So let's go. Banded Herman curl, just like that guys. Keep everything engaged, nice and tight. Squeeze, make sure you squeeze at the top. Come down. And you don't want to fully release at the bottom guys. You want to keep the tension throughout the whole movement. Breathe. Squeeze. Look at me, you can really see the veins flowing man. This workout is not a joke guys, I'm telling you. It's gonna get you looking huge. No time. Sweet. Next thing we're going to do is the banded concentration curl. So now we're literally just going to focus on each arm individually. 10 reps each side. So what you want to do is lift across the body like that. One. And we're going to do alternating. Two. We're almost there guys, almost reached the end of our workout and I can tell you guys must be dead by now but you're doing so well, you've made it this far, don't quit, let's go, no pain no gain guys, no pain no gain, let's go. Sweet, next thing we're going to do is go back onto attacking our chest, I mean our tricep with a bit of our chest and literally just the whole arm as a whole. So what we're going to need now is the strap X. 
So like before, just place your hands behind the handles. Put the cushion part over your shoulders and we'll go to the floor. Okay, with these push-ups, what we'd like to do is go five seconds down and then five seconds up. If you're advanced, you can do two to three reps. If you're a beginner, just do one rep. Okay, sweet. Let's go. Five seconds down. One, two, three, four, five. Pause. One, two, three, four, five. Just keep repeating that, guys. Make sure you're keeping your core tight, guys. Sweet. That's our second to last workout complete. And the final workout to complete our arms are still workout will be shoulder taps. Take a few seconds to catch your breath because this one's going to be intense. Sweet. All right. We're going to go back down onto the floor. I'm going to hold a push up hold again. Like that. Make sure the strap is right behind your shoulders. And we're just going to be doing shoulder taps. Make sure you keep the movement controlled, guys. The bands will be fighting you on this, but trust me, it's going to give you a good burn. And you're going to recruit a whole lot of stabilize the muscles it's gonna rip a lot of microfibers in your arms and give you that thick boulder look that you're after make sure you breathe as well Ooh. what can i say i'm dead and that there is my arm to still work out Let's go. Repeat that for another two to three sets. Or if you're really advanced, you can go for four. And right there, that's how you get your arms in shape. Tita, signing out.